Hello Buzzercars, my name is Hatsu C and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. Uh, we're, we are trying to um, close this off, fix this. And the problem here is this aqua tuner, which is just heating everything off so that instead of less steam, we um, produce more steam. So let's turn it off for now. Uh, and then we already raised it to 18 degrees. Let's raise it to 100. And then let's mop this up. Then eventually we should see that the steam cools down uh, enough so that the hydrogen spreads uh, to the below. We only have water and then we can start pumping things out. Let's also check how we are doing here. No progress. We are getting uh, stuff, gases into our base that I don't want to have here. And we do have quite a bit of carbon dioxide down here. So let's place another one of these. Have a bridge there. Do this. Hook that up to here. And that should help. Then let's see what we have in here. Um, let's take the seed. Um, how are our priorities? Uh, ranching, yeah should get around to it i think we uh we tried to fix that last time okay so now we have hydrogen all the way down there we have 250 water sitting on the floor um we should even be able to enable this building because it is disabled by this high setting Bring a bit more water down there Okay, this one is also built and getting rid of the carbon dioxide down here should lower the, the natural gas up there so it does no longer um, filter into our base. Which is nasty business. And if we hmm, where do we have our power lines? This is already potentially overloaded if if everything is running. Um, this one as well. So. If we want to hook up more things, we would have to run more power lines in here. Because what I'm thinking is that maybe down here we want to uh, 
get rid of the carbon dioxide um, that would deal with a bit of the pressure and then all these nasty gas gases would go down um, the other thing we could try is uh, having conductive wire instead of normal wire but for that we need we need a bit of um, of uh, refined metal So we do have a bit of copper sitting there. Bridge, let's try to build that as soon as possible. And up here the air is getting thin um, we will have a problem with with this one because Okay, we have some steam again. It's probably because the low pressure, maybe. At least in the in the real world, that would work like that. Actually, I can cancel this and deconstruct that one all together. I can also cancel this and get rid of that battery. quite a bit of steam in here sitting a bit over 100 degrees uh, on this side it's condensing eventually we will get there I think And let's see this what not like this. This power line. Uh 
let's be a bit conservative. find the shortest route for the wiring which might not be the nicest one now see the the natural gas layer on this side has gone down that's because we get rid of carbon dioxide down here so we have uh, lower uh, air pressure down here so the gases on top can push things down however inside our base that's that's not true but at least now we have uh, a wire here um, that we can Well, we probably need to dig this out. Okay. Barbecue? Barbecue? Where's the third one? The third one already escaped. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay, we managed to put one poke shell in here. We still have steam down there. Also get things out here. Don't need any brine. It sits something above zero. So the steam, the amount of steam that we have here is going down as it uh, is turned into water. Oh, we will let that sit a bit, let the uh, water cool down. And then let's see. Um, if we have a carbon schema down here and this one, um, then the uh, output, yep, yeah, um, let's build it the other way around. Makes it easier. So then we can do this and this. Then we only have to worry about
and we need a bit of initial water but we do have a water pipe that's going down there so I think can just do this then once this is full we can break the bridge should work out well steam is still going down So let's disable this one and enable the building itself. should have the water in there soon enough yeah let's break this one We just need a bit of uh, sand. Should be good otherwise. Once we manage to get the carbon dioxide down here, uh, out of the way, we should see this layer of nasty gases coming down as well. Now we're looking here. Still quite a bit of uh, steam there. I think down there we are now okay. So we can close this off and stand there. There is now everything steam or uh, steam or water. We can continue with this process, get rid of the, the bot lamp here, and down here we have 250 kilograms of water. Would have liked a bit more, but uh, do not really have that much more water that we can have here and we also no longer need 
this line here. And here the thing, uh, uh, as the gases are dropping further, we can also control this camo with that sensor. So now we have quite low air pressure there. does not need to run constantly. Right. Um. Actually we do not need to pump everything out because we will pump in hydrogen anyway and we will need this one here yeah it's not controlled by the automation wire that's all good Maybe part of the problem is that the uh, oxygen is coming in here, which, while the uh, oxygen uh, tries to settle above, it needs to go through this this layer of, of nasty ga gas. So we'll see how that works out. And we will also see how we uh, do our second try with this setup up here. So join me next time when that will happen. Until then, goodbye.